We're here with Peter Salter from the Bushman Centre on the west coast of uh, New Zealand and he's going to talk to us about the possum. Peter, what can you tell us about the possum? Is it more, is it just a pest to you or is there more to it? And if the possum hadn't been demonised so much and people looked more into it, it's, it's such a valuable resource for this country now because there's a huge demand for the, the actual possum pelt. Just the skin is worth $40. We can manufacture it into uh, different types of garments. The, the fur, which has a hollow fibre, extremely good insulating properties, uh, doesn't freeze. Uh, you've got the pet food market for the meat. Uh, a few years ago, I was getting more for a possum than what a farmer could get for a sheep. In regard to your possum pies, what's the flavour similar to? Uh, well, flavour-wise, we, we always... Uh, couldn't work out quite what they tasted like ourselves. So um, we did an opinion poll amongst people when they when they got the possum pie, and we asked them to write down what they taste what they thought they tasted like, because everybody's got a different idea of what things taste like. Lamb was the most common uh, flavour. So consequently, we we used to put a little bit of chili sauce in with the uh, possum because. The crazy thing about the meat, it has very little flavour at all. It's quite a mild meat. It's less gamey than rabbit. But since people seem to think it tastes like lamb, we now put a little bit of mint sauce in there. The thing about possum, it has an aroma to it, and that's the off-putting part. So once you cook it, if you can disguise the aroma, the meat is basically quite tasteless. The thing, people uh, come in and go, Ugh, you know, possum. And I think, well, look, you eat a pig sa uh, pork sandwich and look at the garbage pigs eat. Possums only eat the best, you know. They're, they're eating the, the young shoots and, and leaves. They're not out there, you know, eating the garbage off the highway. And uh, we've found a little niche market in uh, possum pies. Unfortunately, we can't sell them, but we give them away for a donation. Yummy. Mm, delicious. The thing about possum, it has an aroma to it, and that's the off-putting part. So once you cook it, if you can disguise the aroma, the meat is basically quite tasteless. So um, it's just a case of educating people. The Chinese think they're great, but then again, the Chinese lead anything. <laughs> no, possums are a resource. I've been involved in trapping them for about the last 35 years. There's not the huge numbers around that we've been told. Uh, this talk about them carrying TB, well I've killed thousands of them and only ever found two, and this was back in the 1970s, that had open TB cysts on them. So I think they've been demonised, they've been made to look like uh, some sort of monstrous creature that's cruising our forests, killing off wildlife, uh, native birds, uh, running out onto farms, infecting cattle. It's, it's, it's a fantasy, they're not like that. They're actually, uh, they're a very clean animal. They spend hours grooming themselves. They, never, they don't carry fleas, they don't carry lice. Um, they have a, a brilliant fur, a fur that's in demand all over the world, uh, especially now. And, uh, and we have departments out there hell-bent on trying to eradicate them. Uh, and in the, uh, in the process, they're actually eradicating a lot of our native wildlife as well. So uh, I think they need to whole rethink on how they uh, deal with the possum. You know, if they stop dropping this damn 1080 poison, and maybe if we dealt with it on a, a less aggressive manner as far as trying to eradicate them all and, and switch to trying to harvest so many possum a year, I think we'd have a lot more balanced uh, bush life out there. Because in the days when I started doing it, there was a lot of possums out in the bush, but there were also a lot of bird life. These days, not so many possums, but bugger all birds too. So, you know, that must tell you something. There we go. Well, thanks for that. Thank you. Now that's really good. Go. Yeah. It's a shame there's such a stigma around the possum because that should be made commercially available. It's so good.